Americans. Oh, his battery's going dead. Another friend subscribers around the world. I'm going to have to change this battery real quick. It's been a little bit since I changed the battery. Up here on the fish fences. Uh, thank you to Muskrat and Cindy for uh, coming hanging out down the creek bottom. Man, dude, it was amazing. Uh, girls ended up going to bed. I don't know what time that was, but me and Muskrat just sat out there telling each other lies, <laughs> telling each other stories, and visiting you know and that's the first time we've been friends you know, like I said we talk on the phone and we text and on the videos and you know stuff like that and we always have said man dude we're just we've got to be related and so yesterday you know they ended up showing up and spent the night camped out on the creek bottom man and me and muskrat sat out around the fire last night and we're talking and talking and talking and uh, for some reason well, i think i sold some on ebay or whatever and so i pick up his phone sitting there on a stump and uh my voice might be quiet i don't know but sitting there man my phone sitting there on a stump and i flip it up to see what i sold and i'm a holy crap dude it's 12 30. You know, for these old, these old hillbillies, then I don't even remember the last time I seen, seen 1230, hold on. All right, man, I had to get through that rough patch. Good rough mother right there. So anyway, man, so they ended up leaving this morning and uh, sat around visiting and stuff, drinking coffee this morning, so I got a late start. But I pooped, man. <laughs> Stayed up until... Oh, well, I don't know, by the time we went to bed, it had to be after 1. I said, I don't do that, man. I usually go to bed 8.30, 8.30, 9 o'clock. Man, it was amazing, man. I enjoyed myself just thoroughly, man. Thank you for everything. You guys, that was amazing, man. Absolutely amazing. And hopefully they, uh, going over to see, uh, Muskrat's going to see his mom, and then on their way back, hopefully we're going to end up coming by and spending the spending a night or day or two there with me. If they didn't have to get going, because I think a long haul, then uh, Muskrat would be up here on this fish fence right now, running this, because he would have really liked to. But, uh, and then I didn't. Sorry. I didn't, you know, I didn't like shove a camera in nobody's face or nothing when they first they actually got there, man. It was just starting to get dark. And, you know, man, it was, you know, it wasn't about making videos, man. It was about uh, visiting with friends and just talking, man, and visiting. You know, it wasn't about YouTube or making YouTube videos. But then this morning with coffee, and actually Mad 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 Muskrat was the one that said, man, we should get a little bit of film. So uh, we ended up just turning on the camera, doing our thing, and probably talked about a few things that we shouldn't on camera, so we probably ended up cutting those out. I don't even know if it turned out, so if it did, here it is. No, because I was thinking, because I know that, uh, I know that uh, you hate the shorts, but I see you can do what a great on a trip. Yeah. Yeah, and I might I might do that too if I can but, figure out how to do it again. The yeah. thing, yeah. The, well, you can do the short right on your. Well, I don't know if your phone will do it. Yeah. But, um, I mean, if you just clip them in, you know, with the video, and even if you wait till you get home. Uh huh. I mean, the better. The sooner you start doing one at a time, that's when you're gonna start. Or one yeah. a day, that's when you're gonna start. Probably so. You know, I. You, Ain't, well, I ain't gonna say you ain't gonna get rich because you might. <laughs> I yeah. mean, some of these. But, well, uh, there, there's people that do. Oh, dude, I'm usually not one of them kind of people. Yeah. But, well, that's uh. But, yeah. Uh, well, that, well, I know people that are pulling in over a hundred grand a year. I know oh. them personally. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. You know that are <laughs> just from that. Huh. 
Then it, and then the other, uh, uh, oh, all the other crap that goes along with the social media stuff. You know, I don't. Yeah. I try to, but I'm not. It's not my most. No, I. You know. You know, like you were saying, I, I'm kind of a mostly a private person. I don't like a lot of people around. No. I, I try to avoid them when I can. Well, yeah. Well, that's why I said I put these. You know, and you get the the people. Uh, you know, talking to the people or whatever, and uh, you don't want to come show up, you know, or whatever. Right. And that's right. and I may put myself on the on the YouTube, but uh, yeah. yeah, I'm not. Like I say, I've had a couple of people that. that well, sure. yeah, I'm thank you for. Oh, you know, late. You know, you're I'm always so welcome. Good. You can just pull on in. Good, yeah, thank you. And that's when. Uh, no, it's kind of a funny deal, you know. I mean. Here, we don't know one another, but I feel like we've known forever, you forever. Yeah, ever. Yeah, that's, yeah, exactly. exactly. That's what me and Kitty was talking about that last yeah. night because I was, you know, man, we were, yeah. I was excited for her to get here. Yeah, good. You know, we've talked, yeah, you know, we've talked enough on the, it's crazy. Yeah. You know, like I said, good. we're so much alike that it's just, yeah, that's the thing. It's and crazy. No, and I mean, when they, you know, when I first started this, uh, they've called me Muskrat for 30 years, you know, and I just put muskrat on there, and then I got to looking, and geez, you look up muskrat, there's 500 things, you know, oh, really? so I, I thought, well, that might not work, and uh, I looked up, I was going to put Idaho hillbilly, and then I looked up to see if there's one of those, and that's how I found you, really? and otherwise I wouldn't even Really, that's yeah, funny. And, and I thought, well, that one's took. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, and... Uh, yeah, I just added outdoors to it, and that narrowed down quite a bit. Uh, you know? Well, that's been, that's gotten pretty big, and big, uh, for a lot of the outdoor uh, channels and stuff, call that the outdoors. Stig, man, keep sitting around. Yeah. Just move a little first. There we go. And a lot of the, um, I actually did that. I think you've seen it that one time, and you said, did you just add that to yours? Because I put that. You know, the Idaho Hillbilly Outdoors, I added it oh, to it one right. time when I was doing a bunch of the out, you know, out, yeah. you know, what I do. And then I was like, dude, that's stupid, man. I've been this for forever, you know, and that's been, you know, I went by Hillbilly forever, too. So yeah. it's just, that's, you know. Yeah. I always just go around calling myself, you know, or telling people, uh, you know, when they'd have, what are you, what are you doing? I was like, dude, I'm just going out over here. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's just like, what I is. is. His is so long, and I don't spell very well, you know, and tactical is one of them words. I yeah, yeah. Well, and I don't think that you, you know, I mean, obviously, like, who am I to say, but yeah. uh, the tactical with everything going on and the uh, he, he does suppression. Really, he does pretty good. Does he? He, uh, what's his, what's he got, 7,000? Yeah, he, yeah. But see, he quit for like two months. He was ahead of me, and then he quit. He, they pissed him off. Oh, what happened? They, they, the gun stuff, uh, they're so down on. Absolutely. And he realized that probably five or six of his older videos, I mean, they're like three, four years old, did not care anymore. They deleted them <laughs> and with no warning or anything. And uh, so that, that... See, if they did that to me, I wouldn't know that. Yeah, I have so yeah. many out there that I wouldn't, yeah. and I don't go back on them. And then... Uh, the other thing was, uh, you know, that yellow dollar sign, he's getting a bunch of those, mm -hmm. and, and he's got two strikes against him, and, you know, the third one, they delete your channel, oh, wow. and uh, it's because of reloading. He, he sits there, what he does is, his thing, basically, he sits in his, 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 his workshop there, he's a gunsmith and stuff, so he'll be tinkering on a rifle, and he's talking, and they're... Or he'll be standing there talking, and he's reloading bullets. He's not talking right, about right. doing that. But he's that's, doing. that's against their rules. So, is it really? So, the, yeah, what the reloading is? Yeah, you can't oh, show, you can't show ammo manufacturing or gun modification, which is really? the two things he right. does. Right. Oh wow! And I didn't so, know that. Yeah, and uh, he does some other stuff too. But I, I keep telling him he's just got to. I mean, he's pissed him off so bad that he, he's quit a couple of times and. I got and, uh, it, you know, for a while. Yeah, and I, I keep telling them, just get away from that stuff. You know, mm -hmm. they do a lot of other things, too. You know, we don't have to have that on there. But 
I don't know. It's a shame that they got to censor stuff that bad. Like, well, and it's just freaking getting worse and worse all the time. Yeah. But that, man, you know, mine, I've always just, well, I told you that, or told you about that, that uh, YouTube, when I first started, you know, because I didn't even monetize for the first, uh, oh, man, what was it? I've probably been monetized now for maybe five years, four years, but I didn't monetize for, it scared the crap out of me. Yeah. I was like, dude, I ain't connecting my bank account to nothing. I, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't like that. <laughs> if they can put it in, they yeah. can take it out. That's so, right. Yeah, I That's don't right. like that. And I guess I, well, I ended up making a, um, a different account. You know, a different, ba a yeah. different bank account. Just yeah. in case, you know, the yeah. one that didn't have no money in it. Just yeah. in case, because I was that, like, wow. That's what I did, too. That's the one that I set up afterwards for eBay, too. Okay, yep, yeah, exactly. That's what I got. Oh, Man, I've yeah. got the same. Which now, that was back when they had PayPal. It's now PayPal's went away, so it's not. Yeah. It's still connected to the... The money still goes in there, but it's a whole different... Different deal. Have you even Little sold anything on eBay since the PayPal went away? Uh, yeah, it's freaking. No. It's a little different now. Them son of a bitches hold your money for three days oh, again, really? huh. and huh. that that just agitates me to no end because you know here they are wanting to do this digital dollar thing, you know, or the government, you know, yeah. doing this, and it's instant. And yeah. uh, PayPal was instant, yeah, you know, but yet yeah. all of a sudden now eBay and their new payway isn't instant. Three days. So that's. Oh, somebody, and yeah, we no, actually I, questioned it and said, you know, who's making the interest? Oh, nobody's getting no interest on this. Oh, horse crap. Yeah, You're talking yeah, millions yeah. of yeah. dollars. Well, the, yeah, if they hold that for three days, that's three days interest. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So don't tell me that somebody ain't, but they did. They specifically told us. Yeah. You know, that, that's oh, one thing I don't like this. about that, um, whatever it is, AdSense. Oh, yeah, they're on the YouTube. It's hard to figure out just when, I can't when it is. It. Yeah, I, mean, I, I just kind of ignore it now. But for well, I was there. looking this morning before you got up. was looking, you know, because that one uh, video I did a couple of days, it's got four or 5,000 thing. Yeah, the money's just yeah. mediocre. I mean, I'd do better on my uh, grouse hunting videos yeah. as well, far as the money, but yet I got 5,000 views on this yeah. thing, and I'm only getting $14. I don't understand it all that. It what, how many ads they put on there and what type and right. all that stuff and uh, yeah it's I don't get it I got bad. some of those that I mean been on there now for a couple of years they're like two dollars and you're thinking what's the point of this yeah exactly. I mean, exactly yeah, yeah so I don't I don't understand and I just man like I said when I go to that um, analytics or whatever man I just look at the revenue I mean it's pennies you know yeah. I mean Everybody thinks well, that, that these vet or these, you know, that we're getting yeah. filthy that, rich. That big, that big bear one. That's yeah. the best. That's, the, that's the only one that's done that. I've the other never. one, the other one that surprises me. I almost didn't even put it on there. My my probably second best one, actually the first hand one, probably next in line now. But for the longest time, there was one going the gun holster that I almost didn't put on there. It was too long, long too boring. Really? And, yeah, people. See, and like you always say that, man. I was, I was thinking to myself the other day, I'm just going to start riding his ass every time he says it's too boring. Yeah. It, yeah. Maybe to you. You know, maybe to you it's boring, but yeah. it, that's the thing. They don't. So you think about that person sitting in LA, you know, and that's like the driving videos and stuff. I have people love them. Yeah. And I have people that hate them because the green beans loud. I kind of like that, but sometimes it is a little hard to hear. But but, you can hear it see, and I get complaints all oh. the time, and I was actually going to have you check on there, you know, to <laughs> see if you could hear me. I get so, everybody, Yeah. I don't, you know, I don't get no complaints about it. Yeah. And then somebody will be all, man, I can't even hear you doing that. Yeah. And the thing, my boy, the, the tone of my voice, there was a guy that lived next door to me that uh, had a hearing issue. Let's see that had a hearing issue and he could not my tone he could not hear me i have that trouble with with women and kids it's no kid well you just walk mm -hmm. him yeah. out <laughs> yeah. That yeah. Yeah. that's that she did that yeah. on purpose man. yeah <laughs> but, but there's a guy there's a fella that uh, I, I saw him this summer I, I hadn't seen him in years but we used to cowboy together basically and he was in Vietnam, and he had his right arm blown off clear into the shoulder oh, here with a, with a uh, basically a bazooka. He says a handheld missile, damn. and uh, he was right-handed. Of course, now he's left-handed because that's all he's got. Uh -huh. Everybody calls him lefty. Yeah. 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 He's also deaf in that ear, wow. so his wife would get to griping on him, and he'd 
<laughs> That's awesome. I couldn't That's hear her at all. Man. <laughs> <laughs> couldn't hear a word she was saying. Yeah. And, uh, Just nod. Yeah. Nod and, uh, and smile. After she figured out what he was doing, it made her mad, but it was pretty damn huh, funny. That's you know? funny. So that guy's amazing. He can do anything we can do with two arms with his one hand. Right. And like I said, he didn't start out left-handed. Have you seen that guy that has no arms that shoots the bow? Have you seen that guy, man? He uses it. And man, he's won competitions against nor you know people that do. Yeah. Man, and he lays back like this, man. And did he put dodges the arrow and everything? And I can't even get my legs like no, he does that, man. And leg cramp right amazing, there. amazing. Well, I was just gonna say that Pete McElroy, the guy with the big throwing knives, they used to. Uh, cowboy together, and the, they come to one of those. We always called them the Mormon Gate. You guys should call, oh, yeah. call them Yankee Gate. Right, Yankee Gate, too. And, uh, anyway, it was one of them that was real hard to open. You had to bear hug it to get it. Oh, well, yeah. And uh, Pete, says, Pete, says, Pete says, Bill, I'll, I'll get that gate. And he goes, Why? He says, I can do anything you can do. And Pete goes, You're a damn liar. And she goes, what you say? <laughs> he goes, you're a damn liar. You can't shoot a bow and arrow. And then Bill started laughing. Going, yeah, he got me there. <laughs> 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 did he get out and get the Yankee gate? No, he, yeah, yeah, he Bill did, did it. Huh? But yeah, he, yeah, he's stubborn. But. Yeah, that guy with no hands or whatever, man, he does that. And then he's got a, he puts, pulls the string with draw with his mouth. Huh. Yeah, I'm telling you, you should man, go, or look him up. That, I can't remember his name. And he's been all, you know, he was like on uh, that Sunday morning or whatever uh, TV show and huh, stuff, huh. showing him. Yeah, fixing Pretty fences amazing. with that guy. He'd hold the hammer head kind of kind of like this, hold it sideways, and he'd stick a spike nail right there and slam it in to start it, and then he'd pound it in there. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's That's amazing. amazing. I think, oh, yeah. yeah yep. I, I watched him one time. His kid was in 4-H, and he had a sheep in the, in the pair, and I watched him pick up that sheep's hoof in his only arm, only hand, with the pocket knife in the same hand, and trim that foot. Really? He, he did it better than I probably could have done with wow. both of mine. Yeah. No, oh, it, it's surprising. Yeah. And then, man, what I like, and like the guy with the, you know, they ain't got no arms, their attitude. Yeah. And, that, and that's yeah. why they're amazing at doing yeah. that stuff, is because they're, man, it'd be hard to, yeah. you know, yeah. lose your limbs or... Uh, you know, whatever, not get around, you know. Yeah. It's all about the, well, Bill you know, said the that attitude. He, Bill said he went through that for a while, but he, he said he was mainly just so happy to get out of there and that it was worth it to right. him, you know. And uh, then they had him on a kind of a rehab thing, talking to others for a little while, and I think he was over on the social media. Social media, right. you know, yeah. promote her, uh, positive, what do call that? <laughs> one, of the, one of the funniest things i ever seen. We we were getting up like two in the morning to be where the cows were at daylight, and then you'd push the cows till about noon or whenever they got hot, and they'd start fighting you to right. that, you know. And so then you'd give up and come back the next day, you'd start a little bit behind where you left them because some of them come back. Right, you know? right. Well, we decided that was stupid, and so we decided we we're going to camp out up there. Well, that was fun, and. Uh, P or, uh, Bill and Paul brought a big jug of whiskey. I mean, it was, oh, a, it was like a half oh, hour. And they both got so plowed, so drunk. And uh, the next day, Bill was pretty hungover. And this was really funny. He, he laid down, found a creek, and he laid down to get a drink of water. Well, we kept moving the cows on by. His horse thought he was getting left. So it started to act up and dancing around. And he's got his reins in his hand, you know, right. and he's laying there getting a drink, but well, stepped all over him. Stomped, oh. stomped him into the mud. He tore his pants from, the, from his hip to his knee. And it was so funny because he got up, he was trying to hit that horse, and the horse was going backwards faster, and he, faster and he was going forwards. He kept falling down. He was swinging. Oh, that was so funny. And I don't think he ever did hit the horse. Oh, man, it was funny. But he ended up... Uh, Pretty poor health. He lives in Chalice now. I haven't seen him in years, but he was at the fair this year. So, in Chalice in a long time either. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of crazy. Yeah. Crazy town up there on that. Man, the winds up there. Holy crap, man. I've been yeah. gone through there when the. Yeah. The winds. Then they were having all the. You guys feel the earthquakes when they're doing? They get a lot mm -hmm. of earthquakes right there in Chalice, yeah. man. 
Yeah, a couple of years ago, we were sitting there in the house, and the whole room started shaking, and stuff fell off the wall, even. And wow. It was a good one. Oh, we haven't had one like that. See, now, we had one like that here a couple of years ago, and uh, that was the first earthquake. You know, I'd slept through some that, you know, they'd had here on the side, but... Man, I walked out the, Might have been the same one. The cook probably yeah. walked out the cook shack door, man. That big old cotton tree was just going like oh, this, yeah. man. And I turned around. I'm like, what in the heck? Walked back in, and yeah. as soon as I walked back into the cook shack, he's like, we're having an earthquake. <laughs> and I'm yeah. like, is that what that is? <laughs> that yeah. was crazy, man. Yeah. I've never been in one, or you know, slept through them, but never another one. But I was driving, and I never noticed. You know, and got back home and just, can you feel that earthquake? Yeah. I'm like, no, I didn't even notice. Yeah. <laughs> just yeah. cruising down the road. Yeah, most of the time I don't feel it. Most yeah. of them are small, but they're, they're the they get some big ones. They're there if you look it up. I forget how you do it now, but uh, Yellowstone's got them, like, you know, five or ten a day, every day, but right. they're, they're small. Right. Yeah, if that thing ever goes, we're in trouble. Oh, yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. That'll be worse than Russia. Yeah. Because, man, if it, yeah, if that's well, the biggest. Not, Biggest, uh, ball, I think it's the biggest one in the world, I think eh? So, yeah. yeah, yeah, they're talking about another real big one somewhere, dude. That was totally amazing, man. Uh, oh, I enjoyed that thoroughly, man. If you haven't been over to Muskrat's channel, make sure to go over to Muskrat Outdoors. Whoa. There's links in the uh, description down below so make sure you go over there and like and subscribe and check out his stuff i've been bugging him to uh, well when he was here you know and i did that video where i was telling y'all to go over there and tell him which at this time right now i think that's scheduled for tomorrow but uh yeah free man he's got great stories man so and i've been bugging him to try to get these uh video a day so we shall see. I'm almost getting ready to get to this first food. So uh, let's get her done. Yeah, I forgot I had the, uh, I forgot I had the camera with me. Already started cutting it and had the got the little steel with me. This is pretty big, but man, I'd like to. I wish this was a lot closer. We're a long, long ways from the truck, man. This is a nice, nice lodge pole. But uh, see the fence there? So I've got to get this tree, which is pretty long, by there. Get this tree, cut off this fence. And then repair the repair the fence, and it continues on. But I'm just glad I got the little chainsaw. The big one would be a lot better, but I ain't hoofing it all the way back to the truck for that. I'll tell you that. This is the job. This is what I do. It's what we're here for. On this other side, heck of a heck of a um, good sized tree for this little saw. Like that. Yeah. 
Proven and tested, baby. Proven and tested. All right. I don't have any extra wire with me. I'm just happy I got that with me. If not, I would have been huffing it back. So I had to get this baby. Maybe back up, man. Scavenger, man, scavenger. Uh, definitely not the fish stretcher. When you're out here like this, that is what you got. You got to do what you got to do. Whew. Definitely stretched. So, oh, man. Trees off. Bob wires tightened back up. And we continue on. Life of a fence runner, man. Sweaty. I got out here late, so it's hot. High 80 degrees up here. Continue on.